What's up guys? Welcome to today's video. We're gonna take you through a very special walkthrough of my favorite tackle store in the whole entire world. Thorn Brothers right here. We're gonna take you guys inside. They've done a whole bunch of work to this thing in the last, I'd say six months. And I haven't been here in a month and a half. There's been some big changes through then. So come on inside. We'll show you guys around the store. So right now we're located in Blaine, Minnesota, the north side of the Twin Cities. And this shop has everything you could possibly need for fresh water fishermen. You walk in here and you've got this awesome view. We've got all the mounts around. We've got a whole ton of inventory and they've got some new spaces and some old stuff. This section here I've not seen before. So we're gonna take you guys through that. Um, but let's roll right into, I think what Thorn Brothers is mainly known for their custom rods and a whole selection of other series of rods. We'll take you guys over there right now. So one really cool thing about Thorn Brothers is they've always got some kind of deals going on or some kind of, you know, fudging of prices. They're, they're a family owned store. So this isn't a big box store. There's only one location. You guys can work with the people. Um, we've got a lot of cool sales that they run in the off season, even throughout the store and during the season itself. I mean, 50% off this select rod rack is a pretty awesome deal. We've got a full selection of Shimano rods. We've got some Daiwa stuff, St. Croix stuff, um, and just a full selection of basically anything you want. Akuma, I mean, there's the rods here are absolutely endless. The biggest independent dealer of St. Croix rods in the country. This, company, this store sells more St. Croix rods as an independent dealer than anybody. That's pretty impressive. Um, but the really cool section I like is the custom section here. We've got a bunch of really cool customs here, regardless if it's panfish stuff, bass stuff, walleyes, muskies, you name it, salt water, they can build it. We'll take you guys up to the rod shop a little while later, but you guys can come in, check out any of these rods. They've got a really knowledgeable staff. The store is actually open right now, so maybe we'll bump into some of the employees, some friendly faces, and uh, you know, if you've got any questions at all, all these guys are fishermen. Hey, they've, it's not where you're going to a normal store. It's like, dude, you know, so you get asked by somebody if you need some help, and it's like, you don't know what you're talking about. I'm going to get my own stuff. But these guys know their stuff. They're fishermen. They're really good fishermen and can help you find just what anything in the store. So rods, awesome, awesome selection. And the pair with these, we got a sweet selection of reels. The reel section here, guys, is pretty impressive. If you know anything about what's going on right now with the recent pandemic, inventory is super hard to find. You can see the whole wall here loaded with Daiwa and Shimano is primarily the two companies that they sell. Also got some Akuma stuff, some specific Abu Garcia stuff. Um, and then some specific ice reels and stuff. But this selection is basically unseen right now in the industry. All kinds of different stuff, bass, muskies, walleyes, panfish, doesn't matter. These guys can get you handled. Um, Eric just pulled up actually a bunch of reels for me. These are, uh, are mine I'm taking home with me today. You can call the store, get them all ready to go. I had Eric spool them up right away. So I've got line on there with backing, good to go. I'm gonna go home, throw these on my rods and we're set. You can call ahead. I suggest talking to the employees. You call, they answer the phone right away. They're super helpful on the phone. Tell them what you want. They'll walk you through your options. And I've got a handful of reels here to go home. And I've also got, like I said, some rods upstairs. So awesome display here. You guys can see through the glass case, um, all the different you know, uh, dimensions or materials, gear ratios, sizes, pricing. Everything is right here for you guys to see. You can touch it, feel it, play with it. And these guys can give you maybe some insight if you want on you know their suggestion for what you're doing or what kind of species or technique you guys are doing. So really awesome section here. Now we're gonna take you over to arguably my favorite part of the store, musky baits. The musky section here is kind of the whole perimeter of the shop. And if you guys know me, I absolutely love bucktails, regardless of the size, color, brand. I'm a little bit partial to these ones. This is a huge selection of musky frenzy. We've got it all the way down to this end, and then it goes all the way down basically here um, just incredible selection different colors custom foreign colors um, this was one that re did really well for us it sold really well at the show this year uh, this is a cool custom colors one of our guys luke ronestrand designs all these so we've always got a cool selection of custom colors even different blade combinations thorn brothers has some blade combinations that you get exclusive to thorn you can only get here from musky frenzy um, but outside of the bucktails we've got all kinds of rubber baits uh, we've got top waters, we've got everything you could possibly imagine for muskies. Um, here we get down into like your cowgirls and that kind of stuff. Um, ghost tails, these are a super un, kind of a under the radar bait. I really like these for the small selection, some custom colors. And there's a bigger selection of some other colors over here. Shumway flashes, just your, your staples in the industry. Whole bunch of chaos stuff. Um, I get a bunch of chaos stuff from here. Again, the, the custom colors that they've got with all the companies in the industry. Thorn Brothers has really cool custom colors with. Um, I'm not gonna tell you which one, but one of these colors, Poseidon's, was absolutely money for me last year. Musky fishing, but just super cool selection of stuff. If you guys come over this way, we've got 
the exclusive Thorn Brothers Pound and a Halfer. Um, this thing is a new bait exclusive from Muskie Innovations and Thorn Brothers, 1.5 pound Ultra Dog. Uh, absolutely love this thing. Caught some really nice fish in it last year. Cool colors of that. We've got some leftover show colors from Brad and the guys. We've got cool CJ spinner baits, ace baits, uh, rad dogs, stick piercing grinders, all kinds of your standard bucktail colors. We got some drop tine stuff. This stuff's actually from up in Canada. So they're bringing in baits kind of from all over. Lake X, the stuff can be super hard to find, super hard to get. These guys have got it, okay? Um, again, down here, more sweet custom colors of Bulldogs, and then your standard colors as well. So really, really good selection of musky baits. And man, we're not, we haven't even got to the crankbaits yet. You guys come over here. Um, new 14 inch slammers. These things are absolutely awesome, super cool. Your standard 12s, 10s, all kinds of different slammer baits and colors, shapes, sizes. Swimming dogs, love these things. Absolute staple in my boat. More slammers, I mean, every color, size, shape you guys could possibly imagine. Um, these guys have it. Phantom hexes, these are getting super popular, have been really popular, can be hard to find. Headlocks, matlocks, love that color. Um, this is a Thorn custom color, caught a 52 incher on that one. Um, but just really, really cool stuff. Grandmas, you guys know I love grandmas. I get a bunch of grandmas from this place. They've got everything you need. Rapala Super Shats, doesn't matter um, what stuff you need. These guys have got it. New whale tails, awesome, awesome stuff. Here, even these, like, these are Raps Go Wash Dog Top Waters. This is a guy that makes these in his garage, and Thorne has them here at the shop. Super hard bait to get. Right here, anybody can buy them, have at them. Going down this aisle, more crankbaits, 14 inch jakes. You can never go wrong with jakes, right? Phantoms, reef hogs, hellhounds. I mean, it's just absolutely incredible the amount of stock. Suix, obviously super deadly baits, love Suix. Beavers, I think these are probably the hardest bait, one of the hardest manufactured baits to get right now. Um, really good selection of beavers here. And like I said, you guys, if you wanna get any of this stuff, just call the store, check them out online. They can get you taken care of. Wire, I actually need some of this wire here if I can find this here. This is gonna come with me. This is for building bucktails. Um, need some of that. All kinds of leader materials. Obviously, your boy's got his stuff in here. We got some DWF leaders. Um, Thorne's got some of their own trolling leaders and everything, kind of anything you guys could need for that. Replacement hooks. Hooks are huge. I've obviously got um, a bunch of replacement hooks. Making sure you have the right hooks for the right leaders is super, super crucial. And then the tinsel wall too, like tinsel and components for building bucktails. I like to build a lot of my own stuff. All kinds of different colors of tinsel. We've got all kinds of beads, all kinds of blades clevises, all kinds of cool stuff. So like I said, guys, if, if, if you're looking for any of it, hook files, um, these guys have got you covered. Eric's pulling up a reel right now for somebody. Larry, you doing a good job over there? Trying to. We can watch them work through the glass, but we're gonna take you guys now upstairs to the rod shop. All right, guys, we're now upstairs at the shop, just making our way through the fly section. We'll get into this later on, but this is the rod shop. This is where the magic happens. The boys are at work here, cleaning up some rods. We've got a full rack of stuff over here. I'm actually got a handful of rods here that I'm picking up. I got a bunch of trolling rods here. I've got some musky rods here. Picking up some spinning rods from Buddy Kyle. All these rods are done, waiting for people to pick them up. And Lonnie and the boys are over here working hard. These things all start from the bottom up. They start with just a standard blank. Bring you guys over here. So this section here is just your, your straight up blank. This is how all these rods start, okay? Right here and they can make this into whatever you want. Custom length, action, colors, whatever text you want on the rod, specific reel seats, guides, handle types, all kinds of different options. And this is where it all starts, okay? All kinds of different blanks, action, powers, all kinds of different rods in the mix. This is obviously, these are all orders that are personally, or uh, orders that are going out right now. We're getting work on being finished. We've got some rods turning over here. The guys are working hard, spinning up some guides. Handful of different colors, different wraps. And the, the options here are absolutely endless and it's a true custom rod it doesn't just say custom rod on, on the blank it is truly built from the ground up you can make it whatever you want to make it if the boys are in the in the um, handle shop here we'll see what they're spinning up and then we'll see if they're working they should be you guys doing anything here what are you doing uh, extensions you guys doing anything? so luke right here is actually putting an extension in a rod um what kind of rod is that buddy Ty Sennett Heavy Minus One. The one and only Ty Sennett's musky rods getting built right now. It's the Heavy Minus One. 
So Luke's just put an extension on it. You can see it's built, putting different core frames on, the epoxy, everything like I said, it's built from the ground up. This guy's obviously a fish head. What is that? Absolutely ridiculous. Yeah, DT, DT 10? 16. DT 16? He's in the bass. Nah, we don't want to talk to him anymore. Um, but we've got one guy over here actually uh, reaming out some handles. Go ahead, show me that. So each individual piece for different rods are made up differently. So he's just making it so it fits over the specific blank that's needed. Uh, but like I said, guys, everything handmade, 100% in the U.S. All for you guys to your customers. So we're going to go talk to the master, the wizard, kind of behind the rod shop. If you guys call, have any questions, and you want to talk to the guy, Lonnie is your man. He's actually on the phone right now, so we'll let him finish that phone call. But Lonnie is the guy. If you guys call the shop, you say, hey. I want to do this blank with this length. You know, what do you think on hand, well, my rear grip blank? What do you think on my foregrip blank? What do you think on different materials? Lonnie's your guy or any of the guys in the rod shop. Um, but if I've got a question, I call Lonnie. He takes care of me and gets me what I need. Lonnie's a little busy. We'll let him be to his work. We'll take that in because we're going to walk right through the fly shop. And Stroop is actually up here. He runs the fly shop itself. And now this part of the store just got totally redone and looks absolutely amazing. Um, the biggest fly shop in the Midwest is right here upstairs at Thorn Brothers. Um, awesome display of stuff. These guys just redid the whole display. Um, I actually get some of my boxes here for like my hair jigs that I use for walleye fishing. These are my specific boxes that I use for hair jigs. Absolutely love these things. Um, they're really small, compact. I can stack a bunch of them in there. Now this is up in the fly shop. You can call the guys downstairs or talk to anybody in the fly shop upstairs. They can get you these huge selection boxes. Obviously we got waders, all sorts of sim stuff. Um, anything you guys need. If you're into tying your own stuff, if you want to try a new pair of waders or anything you can possibly think of in fly fishing, Thorne's got it here. So let's take you guys downstairs, look at some bass stuff and the other new room that I haven't even seen yet. All right, so we didn't even get into the bass tackle here. I kind of got distracted by the musky stuff, but they've got a huge selection of bass stuff. Granted, it is spring, so all the ice fishing stuff is put away. These guys have an incredible amount of ice fishing tackle for you guys. Um, I get all my ice fishing stuff here, custom ice rods, shacks, electronics, you name it. Um, we're gonna take you guys through some of the bass stuff here. Not my strongest suit, but I'm gonna show you guys some of my favorite stuff walking through. So one question, I actually get a lot of my lake trout videos is which tubes I use. And I actually use these X-Zones, if we can find them here around the corner. Um, these X-Zone tubes are kind of my favorite ones. They come in a three and a half inch white, and then I just take some sartreuse, spike it, get those done up. Um, but they're a really nice, well-built tube. They're gonna last for a bunch of fish. They're actually right here, I see them. Um, on the other side. So these ones right here, these are kind of my go-to tubes for trout. And I take some spike it with that sartreuse and just get the head and that. But, a lot of people ask me about those, the Howie's tubes. These are awesome for bass. This is actually a really cool small shop at Sturgeon Bay, Wisconsin, kind of over by me. And Thorne brought their tubes over here into the store. Kind of cool, small shops, working with small shops. They make the tubes right there um, and carry them in Sturgeon Bay. You got some cool more stuff from Canada. The Buddy Thatcher, drop tine tackle, all kinds of cool custom tubes. You can use this for Lakers or for bass. Being so close to Mille Lacs here, these guys have a ton of bass tackle. And like I said, I know very, very little about the whole bass world. You got all kinds of drop shot stuff here, Senkos, um, cool savage stuff, just all kinds of different colors and everything else you could possibly need. If I could get Eric over here, he'd give you guys a lot better walkthrough on the bass stuff than I can. But just the amount of swim baits, like look at these jackal rhythm waves, absolutely loaded. If you need any Kitex at all, call the store. They've got a ton of Kitex. I, I, I mean, if I didn't take them all, there will be some left for you, but I, I do do a pretty hard number on these, I will say, throughout the season. Z-Man, Z-Man stuff, um, I'm not even a bass cat. I know Z-Man is like the deal. We've got all kinds of different chatter baits, um, plastics, Z-Man stuff's absolutely awesome. I hook up Jesse with a lot of that stuff just due to the fact he catches a lot of fish and it's so durable. Um, more Another end cap is Z-Man. We got Missile. I don't even know some of these companies. The original Robo Worms. Like, I think these things are still awesome. Not sure, but that's what I hear. Um, missile stuff, KVD stuff, Dival Worms, Big Bite. Basically, guys, anything. Max Scent from Berkeley. Can't go wrong with any of that. All kinds of different jig heads, um, different companies. You've got your Sure Set stuff, kind of your under the radar companies. Make a really good hook, really good jig. Owners, Kalins, and all kinds of really, really good stuff. Yamamoto. 
Everybody knows Yamamoto, right? The original Senkos. Absolutely awesome. And you got all your Ned stuff, more Z-Man. Just this, this store is so full of inventory. It's absolutely insane for what's going on with with the current pandemic. Um, this I can get I can get down with this. This is the smallmouth section. Rhino strand hair jigs. Um, these are awesome. This is actually what I caught my PB Smalley on last year. Love those jigs for for the sturgeon bay stuff, the clear water stuff. Um, any color, these things are great. 16, 330 seconds or eighth ounce. Hog farmer stuff. They've got the Minnesota rigs where you can only run one, or you've got different ones where you can run your three hooks. They've got the dummy keepers. These are kind of hard to find sometimes. So these are awesome. Love these VMCs. Just for running your dummies or multiple baits off your A-rigs. And then there's a lot of grass around here. And boys do a lot of the bucket fishing. So we got a lot of jigs, um, swim jigs, fishing jigs, flipping jigs, all kinds of great bass stuff. Um, Dual Realis, really high-end bass company, really nice spy baits. These guys uh, got it all. Infamous whopper ploppers. I mean, if I have to catch a green bass, I want it to be on top water. And this end cap here is loaded with some awesome river to sea whopper plopper stuff. You got some cool Lake X stuff. You don't see these in the bass world at all. There's a musky company that crosses over into bass fishing. Then, uh, yeah, some more top water stuff, evergreen stuff. I mean, these guys absolutely loaded frogs, jerk baits, crankbaits everything and one really cool piece we didn't get yet to is the sims stuff over here so if you guys are looking for some of the like the best outerwear you could possibly find highly recommend sims you guys know i wear the stuff all the time um they've got everything from the pro dry suits the cx suits the challenger suits the women's insulated suits they've got some really cool branded corn brothers stuff here they've got, they've got their own logo right in here this stuff looks really nice um, fall run vest, solar flexes, absolutely the best go-to. And just a really nice Sims display overall. If you guys are wondering which size you need, which colors you like, you can come see it here in person, ask the guys, and they've got a really good selection of all the Sims stuff here as well. Okay, so this is the new section. This was actually what used to be the old fly shop, and now they've turned this into tackle stuff. They're gonna have a huge sunglasses display. Things are still kind of in the works here. Um, but things are always a work in progress. Every time I come here, there's new stuff with the new ownership the last couple of years. The store's got a huge facelift. Uh, Kurt and Ben are doing a great job with everything. There's a whole bunch of stuff, kind of what, everything that used to be crammed right here is a little bit more spread out. They've still got some ice fishing tackle, like some glide baits, that's like the crossover stuff. Um, walleye stuff. We got all kinds of different line tackle storage, buffs, uh, a bunch of black, they got a really nice black fish display back here. The old school maps, I still like looking at these now and then. Um, just the line, like even like, this stuff can be super hard to find right now. Um, I'm actually going to take that home with me. Um, but I mean, planer boards, anything and everything, you guys. I'm, I'm not kidding when I say this store is absolutely loaded with inventory. All right, uh, one other thing that's super hard to find right now, arguably the hardest find, thing to find right now in the fishing industry, is electronics and electronics accessories. These guys got a nice display here, a couple of units, a lot of accessories. There's a bunch of units above the reels too. If you guys are looking for a specific Helix or Solix or Garmin or whatever unit you're looking for, Hummingbird and Garmin are really the only two companies that Thorn Brothers carries, um, but a ton of bird stuff. Uh, and that stuff is really, really hard to find right now. And then actually over here too, I forgot about the bait tanks. Um, any kind of live bait you guys need, leeches, minnows throughout the season, musky suckers. I know they go through a bunch of these, but really nice big bait tanks. Opening weekend here is just cracking in Minnesota. I know the guys are being running here for some spot deals or any kind of fat eyes, leech and stuff like that for, for open water season. So that's the bait shop. Well, guys, this is my pile from today's visit. Eric's just wrapping up my invoice here. But I also picked up all my rods. I picked up some rods for my buddies. These are basically some of my trolling rods. I got some musky casting rods. Uh, I've got some spinning rods here for my buddy Kyle. Uh, we're going to pack all these in my car, head her home. Maybe out in the water tomorrow. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are ever in the Blaine area, it's worth your stop. Come check out Thorn Brothers. Check them out online, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube. They're on all the social media inlets. And trust me, it is the best store in the world.